This is an Army Today. The Corps of Engineers is beginning a history-making project in New Orleans. The lights, sounds, Ooh, yeah, yeah. and glitter of the French Quarter are less than 100 miles from the Gulf of Mexico. Storm surges from the Gulf can rush through lakes and canals to the most vulnerable part of the city. 42,000 feet of flood walls along the Inner Harbor Navigation Canal are below an elevation of 15 feet. The IHNC is one of the most critical locations uh, for hurricane protection in the city. It's here that the largest design build civil works project in Corps of Engineers history will be, a project that could cost more than a billion dollars. This project uh, deals with uh, a lot of difficult engineering. Some of it is the hydraulics engineering and also the geotechnical engineering. This is a shipping channel, so navigation is a concern, as is the environment. Wetlands line much of this area. Add to this already complicated mix, industry flood walls. Um, we have some walls going through buildings, inside of buildings. Some walls are actually part of the outside foundation of buildings, so in order to raise these walls, you have to move businesses. The project incorporates temporary protection into the ultimate design, meaning the area hardest hit during Katrina, like the Lower Ninth Ward, will have advanced protection by hurricane season 2009. The main goal, the 100-year level of protection, will be complete by the year 2011. The closure project on the uh, Inner Harbor Navigation Canal is, I think, a real milestone in terms of protection for the city. Protection that'll make people in the French Quarter cheer. Cheers! Mary Cochran, New Orleans. That's an Army Today from Washington.